it's definitely a unique experience. You may be able to take courses like this somewhere else, um, but being able to go to the country that you're studying, that's, that's probably one of the things that's the most striking about this experience. We're kind of in a remote setting out here. <laughs> I'm Mark Milhouse. I'm from the Illinois Institute of Technology in Chicago. Um, I'm an information technology and management undergraduate student. Um, in Chicago, we have a lot of different things going on, and it's easy to get lost in that. Um, but instead here, we have the opportunity to really focus on our friendships with each other um, and, uh, and really connect. Um, and that's been really cool. So when I first started getting ready to travel here, I had to ask a lot of people. And um, actually, my, I think my dean had been here um, before. So he was telling me a lot of like, oh, when you go to Helsinki, you have to look at this. You have to come see that. And it was, um, to be honest, it was a little bit overwhelming, you know, to have a lot of people telling me what I should be doing when I come to Finland. And actually, the first week or so, it was kind of an instant success. Like everybody that I that I met was um, was really friendly. We, we kind of bonded instantly, and ever since then it's been kind of the same the same story. Um, we we hang out just about every single night. Uh, we really enjoy each other's company, um, and there's a, there's a lot of just kind of uh, camaraderie going around. So a few of the people that uh, that I met here first. Um, we, uh, we, we still hang out together, um, like even, you know, this is the third week. I knew as soon as, um, as, soon as I looked at the course materials and the um, syllabi for the courses here, um, I knew that I was maybe, not necessarily a little bit over my head, but um, I was definitely out of um, what I've done before. I was, I was really out of my element, um, which is why I came. Um, it was, you know, like I said before, it was an opportunity to, to diversify, an opportunity to kind of experience something new. My program is a little bit business, um, but mostly it's technical, and so it was an opportunity for me to kind of diversify and uh, look at different options. We get to go to St. Petersburg, which was really, um, sounded like a really neat opportunity. One of the best, one of the best moments of my time here, um, at least so far, uh, has been when we sat down with uh, the CEO of a business um, for the Doing Business in Russia course, and he started telling us, he's a Finn, um, and he started telling us what it's like for a Finn to be in Russia, and we were kind of expecting there to be like a Russian businessman there talking to us, and so we didn't really know what to expect. Um, but as soon as he started talking to us about his experiences as a Finn um, in Russia, Doing, you know, running a business in Russia, not just working in Russia, um, but dealing with the Russian economy on kind of a managerial level. It was, it, it was very sincere and, um, and really eye-opening um, to, see, to see the experiences, to hear the experiences that he had to share with us. Um, with the social program here, it's a little bit exhausting sometimes, but it's not a bad thing. It's, um, it's, it's like you spend... I don't know, what, eight hours a day or something like that in classes. Um, and then there's so much time that you spend outside of classes just hanging out and going to like cultural events. Um, things that, that I, especially like in St. Petersburg, the cultural events that we did in St. Petersburg were, um, I would say they were captivating. Something else to come, you know, to come out here and, and study in a different environment with, you know, with different cultures, especially sitting in the room, we're t the Doing Business with China course, um, sitting in the room with, we had Chinese students with us, and, um, you know, the, the professor would say one thing, and then they'd come back and be like, well, you know, from our, our perspective, it's this. From our perspective, you know, we have something, um, something different that we see as a student in China, or um, something different that we've seen in, in the businesses in China. So that was, that was really enlightening. Um, what is the most heavenly language? I don't know. It's Finnish because it takes an eternity to learn. I did it! <laughs> I got us home safe. <laughs>